Good morning from New York City. Before I get into today's episode, I want to say this. It's Labor Day in America, and I'm recording this on Friday, September 1st. And the episode that came out today is called Rocket Fuel, Three Tips to Create a Fun Life. And I'm thrilled to say that I woke up to three messages from listeners. And I just want to say, if you haven't yet listened to Rocket Fuel, episode 105, please take the time to do so. I love the episode. I love this project. And I want to see who might want to come along for this fun experiment we're embarking on. So thanks to those of you who've already responded, and I look forward to hearing from more of you. On to today. Because I knew this morning that I was recording for Labor Day, I went down a rabbit hole researching work and the meaning of work. I read things by philosophers. I read the etymology of the word work and various dictionary definitions. So because today is a holiday, I thought I would be brief and just share two of the quotes that most inspired me. The first is by Martin Luther King Jr., and it says this, No work is insignificant. All labor that uplifts humanity has dignity and importance and should be undertaken with painstaking excellence. And the second is from Khalil Gibran and his book, The Prophet, and it says this, Work is love made visible, and if you cannot work with love but only with distaste, it is better that you should leave your work and sit at the gate of the temple and take alms of those who work with joy. I love that. I think it's important to differentiate between a job, something we show up to do to get paid for, and work. Work is what we apply ourselves to. Work is where we find meaning. Work is love made visible. I think if it's something we dedicate our time, attention, energy, and passion to, in other words, something we derive meaning from, and that can be in painting, gardening, pursuing excellence in any of what is an infinite number of possible passions, it's up to us to attribute importance to it. It's funny I'm saying this because that is absolutely a note to self. I will never forget one day I was talking to my therapist. It was probably a couple of years ago. And we were talking about work. And she looked at me point blank and she said, Constance, you know what your problem is? I was like, whoa, that's not the kind of question you expect from a therapist. I said, no, what? And she said, you're not valuing and attributing importance to your own process. That's on you. And she was right. And it woke me up. And I will say, I still struggle with it sometimes when people ask me, what do you do? I can feel the question coming. I clench my stomach. And I usually say too much because I'm trying to justify myself in some way. To close, I would say that by that definition from Khalil Gibran, work is love made visible. Dear Constance is absolutely part of the work I'm doing in the world. It's a labor of love. It's something that I derive meaning from. And it's meaningful to me that you listen and that you let me know you're out there. I appreciate it. I'll leave you with that thought today. Until next time, from my heart to yours.